Hi, I'm Peter Kalmström of Kalmström.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I'm going to go through the safe as bolts exercise, where the goal is to fill in all the formulas. And these are only summaries, so it uh, should be rather straightforward. I'm just going to summarize each and every one, and then we're going to do a summary down here of all the budgets. We have screws, bolts, tools, and nails. So the way to do this is to press select the cell where you want to add a formula, do the auto sum, check that the suggestion is good, and just press enter. And then you can actually just fill down, because this is all the same formula. So it's summarizing the four cells to the left of the current cell. So that's why I can just fill down like that. Same thing here, all departments, auto sum, press enter, and then I'm summarizing all the cells above B7 to B B11, if I select that, those are the four cells starting five cells up. Right? So I can fill that out. So rather straightforward, auto sum, enter, and fill down, auto sum, enter, and fill to the right. And if you want to do it even quicker, you can do the auto sum, enter. Oh, that's totals. See that one coming? So let's just put that as a number. You can do that on all of these. $700 there. And then I just paint that format and do that all over there. And now when I double click this, it sticks. If I click it once, then I select the format, for it lose it after just changing the format of one cell. But if I double click it, now it's going to stick. So let's see, I'm going to double click that. And now you see I can paint this all over the place. All the place where I want the same kind of formula to, the same kind of format to work. So that's done. Excellent. Now I can just click it away. So again, let's do this. And I'm filling down here. I'm doing the auto sum there. Pressing enter and then filling out to the right. An even quicker way of doing it actually is if I remove these formula words there and just select all of the cells that I want to calculate and the space where I want the auto sums to go I can just do auto sum straight away with everything there. Now the total is a little bit more tricky. You have to do the summary of the tools, nails and the screws and the bolts. So let's zoom out a bit so we can fit everything in one screen. That's a bit much. There we go. And now I can just do this. Equals. I can't use the auto sum now. It's very tempting to always use the auto sum, but in this case I can't. So I'm going to do this plus. Oh, that's screws, right? And then we do the tools plus. Another plus. Just keep tapping the plus key. Plus that. Plus that, and there you go, 549. Let's do check if it's correct. 250 plus 100 is 350 plus another 450, yeah, 549. So it did the math right. Now you're foreseeing a bunch of other boring clicks here, but you can actually fill this out since it has the same format. I can fill this out to the right, and it's going to do the, the uh, same calculations there. So let's check that if it does the right thing, and yes, it does. And now I can just um, fill down, escape out of that edit mode there. And now I can just select all of these and fill all the way down. Remember that little fill handle at the right? I'll just fill that all the way down. And this row, I don't need the summaries there. And let's just check that this one is doing the right thing. And yes, it is indeed. So here we do a lot of calculations. And I think that concludes this demo. Thank you for watching.